I recently had the privilege of participating in an IBM leadership program that um, is designed to serve a number of purposes. One, to grow leaders in, um, by immersing them in other cultures and giving them opportunities to work on projects they would otherwise not have any access to. It's also um, got a marketing spin on it in that it helps to create some demand in some of these growth markets where we're really looking for the future of the company to grow. The, the program is called the uh, Corporate Service Corps, and it's for high-performing um, non-executives. And recently, they added an executive program that's a little less time. It's three weeks as opposed to a full month, and executives get to participate in this program as well. I, um, with much hesitation, applied for this program, thinking I probably won't get accepted, and even if I do, how can I possibly leave my family and my job for so long, and then got accepted. And I sat down with my husband, we figured it out, and uh, I embarked on a, on a journey to Jakarta, Indonesia, um, soon after figuring out exactly where Jakarta is, because I, I didn't even know where it was on the map. Uh, so flying halfway around the world, immersing myself in a culture that's so different from anything that I've ever known, working on the traffic problems of Jakarta, which is something that I knew nothing about aside from sitting myself on the LIE, um, and, you know, preparing and, and, and living with leaving my family for so long were just a, a, a number of, of different things I had to contend with. In the end, um, I can claim success on all fronts. Really, we did a fabulous job, the team in Jakarta. We really, five of us who knew, did not know each other and, and were not um, specialists in the smarter traffic arena, came up with some very successful proposals that we prepared for the governor of Jakarta and, um, and left them wanting more from the local IBM team in Indonesia, which was ultimately a big success. The other successful parts of this journey for me were um, just learning about this new culture, gaining new friends. I now have a mentee who lives in Indonesia, in Jakarta, and we speak once a month, and I'm her mentor, and so she, we really get to, to swap stories from our different markets on a regular basis. Um, I learned that I know a whole lot more than I actually thought I did and had something to contribute about a subject that I wasn't entirely confident about. And I also learned that my, my two girls and my husband could survive without me, aside from their nails needing to be clipped and a couple of things not in the right place. Everybody really thrived. And, um, and ultimately, I think it was, really, it was a win-win experience for both the IBM company, the local Jakarta team, and for me personally. And, and I, what I take out of this as an insight is that sometimes the scariest thing that you ever do could just, it just reaps the biggest benefits and you need somebody to push you out of that plane in order to be able to, to experience that.